Let me demonstrate. As you can see here, the DVR is connected to the modem router using an Ethernet cable, and make sure that the LAN indicator on the router is blinking. After confirming that the connection between the DVR and the modem is working fine, we will now return to the DVR monitor screen. Please navigate to the configuration menu, then go to the network menu. Here, make sure DHCP and auto obtain DNS are enabled, and then click apply to save the configuration. Once you click apply, ensure that your DVR has obtained the IP address automatically from the router. Next, please access the platform access menu. Make sure you have enabled the HitConnect service. When you enable the HitConnect service, you will be asked to agree to the service term and policy statement. Click OK to confirm. Now, the connection status is online. For security purposes, make sure you have also enabled stream encryption. If there is a warning, simply click close. Then, click apply to save the configuration.